personal style has gone from like nerd, flared up jeans. My family didn't grow up the richest, so he wore pants that could fit you for multiple years. To go from that to wearing some of the high-end clothes that I wear now, and some of them being given to me for free, it's been a real crazy evolution of blessing. I danced a lot and then modeling came and just kind of presented itself to me and I latched onto it real quick. And I was like, oh, I could travel the world with this at an early age? Bye guys! Kept it in my life since I was 12. I strongly suggest models to take like just an expression class, whether it be like dancing, whatever it is, like something to get you out of your element and teaches you how to move. My best advice to Filipino models is understand what your purpose is and just go for it. And don't allow somebody to tell you no. I'm working with the Department of Tourism. Yeah, I want to get to where I'm going in life and build the people that brought me there and continue to give back to my community. And it makes me a kind of emotional because we put so much time and effort into this. And I've tried to come here to the Philippines so many times and it just never worked. And now it's like working, so it's like you finally know that it's aligning. And it, it makes me a little emotional because it's a really big journey for me. And I wanna like, there's a lot of people hurting out there here, this country, and it makes me really sad to know that there's a lot of people with a high status and they don't even really care to give back to their community. I want to be that difference and I want to help any way that I can. I came to the Philippines to find myself, to touch base with like my ancestors and to understand who I really am. Because without you guys, I wouldn't be who I am. It's okay to step back from what you're currently doing to find yourself. It's okay to say no sometimes to figure out what your next step is. Sometimes it takes a step back to understand what your next steps are going forward. Look at what you created for a moment and then maybe when you take that step back you're gonna realize how to leap forward and take the risk of something else bigger than what you have in front of you.